All right, this is my Ward's Master Quality rotary mower. Now, the way the self-propelled works, this is your input pulley for the trans. This shifts in and out for the clutch. Um, nothing's all together yet because I'm just, you know, I'm putting it together, but I'm also doing a little show you how the thing works a little bit. So let me get this off. Now, see, so this is the drive gear. Got it up bearing. Uh, this little metal fork here is what you use to hold the gear centered. And here you got a lower bearing. They're nice bearings in here. I don't know if nice is still in business or if they got bought out. Um, and you see here is how the clutch works. Basically it just flings this in as it's turning. So that would be that and then like I said this rod here just in out. This is a free floating gear, your actual drive gear. And the one here for the actual clutch, we'll pull this out. Come on. This one's on a keyway. So it basically slides on the keyway. So once this is slid into engagement it locks it so the gear is held to the shaft. Uh, you see these spirals here on the ends of the axle. That's to help pull the oil into the bushings. These bushings on the outer ends are actually lubed from here. You got a little ball, spring ball bearing. You put your oil drops in there and the oil will drop down onto this bushing here. So, that's how that part works.